very similar but very different cars. To my left, British Racing Green. To my right, Rebel Green Mini Cooper John Cooper Works. So what I'm going to do in this video is compare the two. See how they're way up? They're both similar ages, same generation of Mini, but there are some differences. British Racing Green, it's, it's quintessentially British in my opinion. And then it's got the black styling pack. And as I said before, it's the John Cooper X, so it's got the power to back it. Now, similar to the other Mini, it's got the gloss black roof and the gloss black mirror caps, but then it's got the side stripes as well. And this is the all four, which is four wheel drive capability. Now, the first difference I want to talk about, these alloys, these are diamond cut and gloss black, 19 inch. I like these, but I also like the other ones. We'll talk about them soon. Passenger wise, they do actually get a lot of space. In these, we have the sports seating. I want to talk about the front sports seating because similar to the rear, they're very nice, very comfortable, but they're better. Now, this is the six door, so we're comparing a six door to a three door, so bear that in mind. There are going to be differences. Let's take a look at the boot space. Look at that, automatic tailgate with your foot and the other one, I think, somehow. There we are, first time. So boot space on these is actually really, really big. I just love the doors, how they swing outwards. That's so cool. And then for the rear bumper, you get the air vents there. It's different to the Mini, um, but still looks just as good. It's stylish, but in a different way. Maybe slightly more subtle, you could say. Now let's compare how it is to be a driver. In this one, my favorite thing about this is the steering wheel. Little flat bottom, part Alcantara, then part leather with the paddles. This particular model is also fitted with a panoramic sunroof. As well as that, let me start it up because they both sound good. Now, if you can hear me over the exhaust, this one's got heads up display and so does that, which is cool. And what I like about both of them is the start stop button. Minis, let me turn this off. Minis are spaceship like. You get all the toggle, it feels like you're a jet fighter. You get the toggles here and then you get the toggles there. So that's how everything works in the Mini with the toggles. It's so unique and different to any other car I've been in really. As well as that, this one's got Harman Kardon. So if you're into your music, brilliant. But let's compare it to the Mini. How does that, how does it weigh up? So as I said before, this is a much darker green. Through the camera, it might look almost black. And when it first arrived, I thought it was. Um, certain lighting, it looks black, but it is actually a very, very dark green. Fantastic color as the British Racing Green is. Moving around the vehicle, it's also got the gloss black styling. So the gloss black badges, the gloss black grille, the gloss black rims around your DRLs, and then the gloss black roof as well as well as the mirror caps. But let's talk about the rear because the thing I love about both of these, I didn't mention on the Countryman, is the Union Jack lighting. I just think that's so unique. And on the Mini, they're laid out like this. So you've got half the Union Jack there, half on the other side. It's very similar, but it's almost just flipped on the side. So the rear of the Mini Cooper, John Cooper, how does that compare? On this one, you get sort of a different diffuser. Very aggressive, gloss black there with the twin tailpipes and then the carbon fiber wrapped around them. So that's super cool. Now the alloys on this one, these are gloss black and just the John Cooper Works alloys. So they do differentiate quite a bit. So this is a mini, you don't buy a mini because you want a lot of space, do you? But as you can see, you do get enough space in there. Yeah, you can probably fit a sandwich in there. Right. Inside, I promised to show you inside both, so I'm gonna. These seats, how are they different? Both heated by the way, they're full leather, but the headrest, look at that. So on this one, you get the Union Jack perforations in the headrest. Yep. So how do they compare? The main thing for me is the color. They're both green, but this one's just a lighter green. This is a darker green. I like them both. Both got gloss black styling. Both got similar front bumpers and then the mini DRLs. It's whether you want a little more space in the Clubman or you're happy with the space you get in the Cooper. But as I say, both these cars are for sale. Both unique and special in their own way. But if you want to inquire on either of these, just give me a Terrier call and we'll help you out. Thanks for watching.